Hey guys, what's going on? Mohammed again, back with another video. In this video, I'd like to talk to you about how I have used the new update, updated personal conveyance without, without any violations triggered on my ELD. The other day, I went to a shipper. They took their sweet time on me to, to load my truck. So right before they finished, uh, right after they finished loading, they had a sign that said that all trucks must leave their property within 30 minutes of receiving their shipping papers. So what I did was I got my papers and I was on, on sleep because I was out of my 14 hours. I didn't have any more hours to be on duty. And using the new rule that just came out two weeks ago, I have uh, turned on my, switched my sleep from, if, of my sleep to off duty and then enabled a per, a off duty a, a personal conveyance or off duty driving whichever one you want to call it the and then i i went to a, a loves that was 30 miles away from me and the rule before initially when it, when the personal conveyance rule came out on elds they wanted to uh, make sure that you did not have any trailer attached to your truck. But now they changed that rule. You can have a trailer attached to your truck, whether it's empty or loaded. It doesn't matter as long as, as long as you're using your, uh, as long as you're using personal conveyance to go from a shipper or a receiver to to a place. Uh, whether they they called a safe haven it doesn't matter what it is it could be a rest stop a rest area or it could be a, a truck stop whichever one you prefer so I used that rule and we didn't have that rule before and I, I was super happy and excited that at least I could move instead of fighting with the shipper and saying hey this truck cannot be legally moved from here I was able to move it move it from uh, from the shipper to a truck stop, which was 30 miles away from me, uh, and not get in trouble with the law or with the federal government. Right. So uh, there's there's also one thing that we all need to know. You can only use personal conveyance while loaded or have a trailer attached to your truck. Only if you're going from a shipper to a rest area or to a, to a truck stop, to a safe haven. You cannot use that to the law or the rule specifically states that you cannot use personal conveyance to further your dispatch. Let's say you cannot be going towards your dispatch or you can that's for that you're supposed to be on duty. But I used this rule and it has really helped me get out of trouble uh, arguments with anyone. I went to the truck stop and finished the rest of my 10 hour sleep and went back to sleep and my hours came back regularly on the right time that they were supposed to be back after 10 hours. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos like uh, tr on trucking, personal uh, conveyance and hours of service. And again, thanks for watching. Talk to you in the next one. Peace.